Hey guys, what's going on? It's Carl here back with another video. I know this has been requested on social media. If I can update my tech travel guide or what's in my bag when I travel, I happen to book a super last minute flight. I am leaving tomorrow to France to visit my parents. I have two weeks before my internship starts. Scrambling to say the least. So when I travel, I normally carry this as my primary device. It's my iPad. But since I have a place of operations or a home base where things won't get stolen and I can just leave my laptop around, I am bringing my 15 inch Retina MacBook Pro with me. I also have another assignment to do. I'm hoping to get that done while I'm on the plane. And all the things you're about to see, I carry with me in this backpack. It's a Herschel backpack. It's not really tech related and it's just simple. It looks pretty cool and it works. All the items that you see in this video, I will link down below in the description box. So without further ado, let's kick things off. So as I said, primarily the MacBook Pro will be used to edit some video work. I'll be taking a lot of footage of my trip, hoping to get a few vlogs up as well as my homework. And it's handy that I do have a place to store it. Next off, it's not even here because I'm filming with it. It is the Panasonic GH4, which is sitting on top of the tripod. This is the box, and this is an awesome piece of equipment. I highly recommend this to anyone that's looking to record in 4K, a solid video camera, DSLR, and it also has the option to switch to stills. Highly recommended, can't praise this camera enough. Next off, I think is probably the most important thing, of course, is the passport. Without this guy, you are going nowhere. Not really tech related, but if you don't have this, None of this stuff makes any sense. Next off is my Nintendo 3DS XL. This is the Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds bundle. And the game I have inside, of course, is my favorite game ever of all time, Majora's Mask. Love this thing. We'll be playing this a lot while I'm on the plane. Switching to some audio, the Sony MDR-1R over-the-ear headphones. These things will be saving me once again while I'm on the plane, if I'm hanging out on the beach. Nice solid kit of headphones. Next off will help me with my video work. And this is a Gorillapod and it will bend in every sort of direction. So if I want to set up my camera, make a few vlogs, wrap this around a tree, place it on the beach. Extremely handy to have and it's great for people that are on the go as it's super light and will fit into your backpack. Next off, my GoPro. Using this a lot when I'm, say, doing a bit of action, I'm biking around, I'm swimming. I can always take this with me on the go. It is waterproof. Great for recording some footage that you don't really want to, say, have your cell phone, have your expensive DSLR. If this thing breaks or if it were to fall, you're only losing three to 400 bucks compared to say the 2000 DSLR, which I'm uh, using, or say my iPhone 6 Plus, which is near $1,000, which is my go-to smartphone device. Awesome battery life, it takes great pictures, it's fully unlocked, so when I get to France, I'll just pop in a new SIM card, and I can use this while I'm on the go. As I said, the camera on the iPhone 6, I wanna say is unparalleled to any other smartphone. Don't hate me, it's just the truth, my opinion. Plus, I can Periscope on this, and Periscope is only available on iOS. Not yet available on Android, but I'm sure it will. Right there, those are two 64 gig cards, which I'll be using to interchange with my Panasonic GH4. A lot of footage, I don't think I'll be recording in 4K on my trip, just 1080p. Maybe some 60 FPS, we will see. And last but not least, this is the Mighty Wonder Cam Grip. And what you do, you pop on the GH4 on here. It's got a nice little quick release plate. Press the button, out this slides. You'll attach this to the base of your GH4 or whatever DSLR you have. Slide it back in and you can glide with the camera, control it a lot better. You'll get way smoother shots. Interested to see how this works and we will see what kind of video footage I end up getting on my trip. So these are the tech items that I bring with me when I travel. If you guys travel often or bring your tech with you, let me know what you bring down below in the comments. I'm also hoping to grab the HTC One M9, Galaxy S6 slash S6 Edge, and the new MacBook, all those things when I get back. 
So be sure to subscribe to the channel and stay posted. Also, follow me on social media. I'll be updating my trip details, taking a lot of pictures, maybe even do some vlogs. I've never really thought about that before. Let me know if you want to see some of my vlog footage or some footage of my trip down below in the comments. Hoping to get there safe and sound, this video will be up the day I leave tomorrow. And as for everyone else, have an awesome, awesome day, and I will catch you in my next episode. Peace.